A report by the Atascadero Mutual Water Company has been released showing abnormal levels of copper in tap water. KSBY News reporter Fabiola Ramirez looked into the report and is now live with details. Fabi? Well, Karina, samples were a lot higher than allowed by the EPA. I spoke to the health department about what this violation can mean for water users. A report by the Tascadero Mutual Water Company details where their drinking water comes from and what is in it. The water tests were performed between January 1st and December 31st of 2017. They found that more than 10% of the first draw samples were above the action level of 1.3 ppm, which is a violation of the EPA's lead and copper rule. It makes me nervous because I have two children and I make food from the tap water. We don't drink tap water from the tap, but you know. We do make all of our meals off the tap water. Dr. Bornstein with the San Luis Obispo County Public Health Department explains that some people who drink water containing high levels of copper over many years may suffer liver and kidney damage. The water company explains that the excess of copper in the water can be related to the corrosion of the copper plumbing in people's homes after it sits in the pipes for an extended time. Water filtration is a great answer for this. It gets rid of copper in the water. Not everyone can afford Brita filters or, or the like. Um, there are other thing devices you can put on your tap water. The Atascadero Water Company says they're adding a small amount of orthophosphate to prevent future corrosion in the pipes. County health officials say they will monitor the copper levels to make sure they drop over time. Either way, some residents say they'd rather take extra precautions. Anytime you can filter something either through a filtration system or the RO system, then yeah, I think it's safer that way. County officials recommend running the water for 15 seconds before using it to cook or to drink. And of course, use that water for something else like watering plants so that it doesn't go to waste. Live and local in San Luis Obispo, I'm Fabiola Ramirez, KSBY News. Fabi, thank you. And for residents who use well water, it is important to test the water once a year.